pressure of liquid depends upon three factors depth of the liquid, density of the liquid and acceleration due to gravity and that's why I want to present this in terms of equation look at this pressure of liquid is equal to depth of the liquid or height of the liquid density of the liquid and acceleration due to gravity out of these three factors now I want to focus on second and third factor this D and Z pressure of liquid is directly proportional to actually density of the liquid and it is directly proportional to acceleration due to gravity also look at this I want to focus on this to how pressure depends upon density and acceleration due to gravity I have taken four different liquids one is oil, another is water and salt solution and mercury in a beaker, they are identical beaker and all of them contain same amount of this uh, liquid in terms of height, in terms of volume and what is found if we measure pressure at the bottom of the container beaker which contains oil this pressure is less in comparison with pressure at the bottom of the water and it is more in salt solution than that of the water and it is more than in mercury than that of any other liquid what is the meaning all of them contains same amount of liquid depth of liquid is same this S is same but even after being same depth pressure of liquid is found to be different it is highest in mercury less in salt solution more or less in water and least in oil the reason is very simple density of mercury is highest among all these and a little less in salt solution less in water and very less in oil that's why pressure of liquid depends upon density of the liquid if density is more pressure will also be more now let's take another example <clears throat> let's talk about third point acceleration due to gravity if one of these say this beaker filled with water is if taken to North Pole and uh, if pressure at the bottom of this beaker is measured over there then then again the same is taken to equator at this place and if pressure at the bottom of the beaker is again measured what is found pressure is found less at equator but more at pole and this region is nothing more than z acceleration due to gravity at pole is more and that's why pressure is more and acceleration due to gravity at equator is less that's why pressure of liquid is found to be less at equator this is the relation of pressure with depth depth i told in previous class density and acceleration due to gravity now let's talk about uh, these three factors which affects the pressure i want to solve one numerical problem related with this equation look at the problem Height of the column of mercury in barometer in this much is density. If density of mercury is this much, calculate the pressure of the mercury column. Now, what are the given? Given I am writing. Given uh, uh, this height of mercury, height. Height of the column of the mercury, which can be denoted by S, is how much? 76 centimeter centimeter can be converted into meter by dividing with 100 and this gives 0.76 meter and then density now density density of mercury is given as 13600 kg per meter cube and the Calculate the pressure is true. That's why pressure P is equal to question mark. Here we know that G equal to 9.8 meter per second square. We have P equal to S D G and value of S is given 0.76 into 
and value of density is given 13600 and value of Z we know 9.8 I am not writing units in the process we are writing unit uh, uh, in the given in the given only and in the answer only it's not necessary to write unit in the process it makes us confused uh, that's why I ignore this now if we multiply all of this then I multiply here the value comes 101292.8 101292.8 and this is pressure and we know that SI unit of pressure is Pascal if all these terms are taken in SI unit then answer also comes in SI unit that's why the answer is in Pascal it means pressure exerted by this mercury column is 1,1292.8 Pascal this way we can use uh, this equation to calculate the pressure of the liquid 